Hey, what's up my chefs? Chefy here again. And today I'm going to be showing you a little concept that my friend has showed me. This is it right here. You can do it with whatever material that you would like. I just did it with these because it was easier to see. Um, so here is the wiring. So basically, this is a combination lock. Um, so down here, um, you want to choose what you want your combination to be. So currently you want all the torches lit to unlock the door. But let's say I want um, to unlock the door, you have to have the blue one lit and the white one lit and the demon torch lit. So then up here in order for them to unlock the door they have to have the blue one lit the demon torch lit and the white one lit and then as you can see right here all the pathways opened up for the bird to open the door here I'll show you the wiring again so basically you just connect it like so um, and um, this lever activates the bird statue and the bird flies this way first um, and if it's blocked off it will fly this way and hit the dart trap um, but if it goes all the way through then it will hit this pressure plate which will open up the door um, so I'll kind of do a demonstration here let's show you with a blocked pathway so the bird goes and then it's blocked and then it comes and it gets killed but if it's the right pathway then it comes and does that so then the door opens up and you can walk through the reason why I did it like this is so that way you can't just walk back out um, and that way enemies can't walk in as you're walking in so it basically closes it so you can't walk out and stuff so then you can get your treasure or whatever's in this room and then you can teleport out and then there you go so yeah that's just the concept of the combination lock um, usually when you do this you want this part of the combination to be way underground so nobody can see it so that way all they see is just this part right here um, so yeah that's it thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed and see you guys later